joining. Thanks for watching uh, another video. Um, today we're going to showcase some tools to you. If you make turbo manifolds out of schedule elbows, uh, and then these tools are going to be very beneficial to you. So what these tools allow you to do is it allows you to set um, a cut angle onto your elbow um, and then it allows you to then clamp it in your bandsaw or mark the tubing ready for cutting. So in total we currently offer four variations of these cutting fixtures. We offer inch and a half, inch and a quarter in both long radius um, and short radius. And this is the fixture itself. This is uh, the inch and a quarter one uh, that we've got in the hand here. Um, I'm just going to quickly demonstrate uh, how you use it. It's, uh, it's dead simple, you can't get it wrong. Um, all you need to do is cut yourself a bit of uh, 1.6mm welding wire. So this is the fixture up close. And as you see, we have these series of holes on both sides. Now what this is, this is your degree gauge. It goes up to 45 degrees in five degree increments. And you take your 1.6mm welding wire and then you put it in your desired cut. Uh, for example, we've got it set at 25 degrees right now. And then as you see inside there, it forms a stop. And then you just simply push your elbow in until it touches that wire. Get an Allen wrench, tighten it up. And now that is ready to be either inserted into your bandsaw vise or you can get a pen, you can draw around it and that gives you a cut line if you was, do, if you was doing this with a, a cutting wheel or an angle grinder. And if you are using this in your bandsaw vise, it's dead simple, obviously don't forget it's, it is plastic um, but it is fairly durable and these can last a long time providing you take care of them. Uh, and providing your bandsaws all set up correctly um, and all you do is you would just put this in your vise and you would just put this up to your bandsaw blade uh, on this surface here using it as a sort of uh, a fence reference and then just push it back a fraction of a millimeter just so the blade isn't touching the plastic and um, because if your bandsaw isn't that well set up uh, and you know it's going to chew the plastic uh, fairly easy How much does it cost? Well, each individual fixture is £25 each. Uh, we'll put a little USD conversion just here. Or um, we sell them as a set for £80 for all four, all four that you see here. Or you can buy them in pairs. So if you're going to do inch and a half, you can buy an inch and a half pair. If you're going to do inch and a quarter, you can buy an inch and a quarter pair. Now, there are some billet versions on the market machined from aluminium. Uh, the downside is, you know, they're, they're roughly £120 each um, and they only cater for the long radius bends um, in one size. So, you know, if you wanted to cater for all four of these, you know, you'd be spending $500 plus. Uh, whereas we're giving you the full set here for £80. Um, dirt cheap, there's, you know, at that sort of price, uh, just the sort of thing you'd have in your toolbox just in case. Now, there's no reason why these couldn't be used by the professional user, you know, providing your bandsaw set up and the blade's not going to wander and shoot the plastic, there's no reason why um, these fixtures, you know, will last you a long time.